actually I born in Mogir and uh, the, they are belong from the king family of This way, I fortunately get the all opportunities to see about the opponents, the topmost comforts of in my life from my childhood. without doing nothing because they are very rich, they are king, they are richest in Bihar, many, they have empire, they have all facilities, all comforts, and I was availing from my childhood that without doing no efforts for anything. When I start my childhood, they sent me in Catholic school and I was studying there. And I have a too much respect for Jesus because I was in Catholic school and I start praying to Jesus. So, I realized that this is also good for me, that I have to know other religion. Knowing other, first I was in the Vaishnava's family and they don't bother to send me there. And I start my life there. And that is good opportunities to understand many things for me to know the respect to other religion, to know about that is also very important. So at the at this site, if you see, I learned from the childhood to read the Bhagavad Gita. I start learning from my childhood about the Bhagavad Gita. Dharam Kshetre, Guru Kshetre, Sambhita, Yusavaha, Mamaka, Pandava, Cheva, Kimkurva, Sanjaya. From this Bhagavad Gita and one side is a Catholic way of living and doing the things. So that both help me in my life. Still I feel this and I can feel that what is happening when you got the right place to grow up is very good. So my parents take care of me very nicely. They send me to school, colleges, and I try to learn. I graduate and To, in young age, I was only to expend money because money is no problem. I don't need to earn because there is so much money to expend. Only I have to plan how to, where to expend the money and what I need to do. Only my desire is fulfilled. If I want something, the parents fulfill my desires. So this way I start growing, then I have desired to do some business. I do business. I grow many things. I do many businesses, making properties, growing them. Income of the states, I start doing this. 
After that, I have no satisfaction with this. And this way I want to go for more. And then I think to go for the spiritual life. Because I see my parents are also very spiritual, very nice, very humble for others. So that way I think to do this. I like to read only the books, what is beneficial in the life. I never read the novels or other things. I have no taste for that. I always read how to help others, how to serve to others, how to love to others. That is my desire to do in my life. And I am trying to do that way. I do effort for that. Oh, yes, that is very, very, I am grateful for my parents. My grandparents are very religious, very pious, very humble. After they are king, they are very soft, soft spoken, very kind for others. Uh, and they never want to give pain to anyone. They are very kind. There are many stories happening in their life. I know, but it's long to say. But I can say you, they are very pious and very kind, always helping to the people, kind for others, caring to others. That was a big impact for me. My father is very loving. He never fight with anyone in any issue. He is very caring and very loving. Because my Gurudev said that Prabhupada is the expansion of Nityananda. He is Sat. He is a, what do you say? Vesha Avatar. Shakti Avesha. Shakti Vesha Avatar. So, I believe his words. And I went to see Prabhupada. And when I went to see Prabhupada, he was very busy with his meetings with the GVCs. When he become free, he give time to talk with me, and I talk. And he was so kind. He wants to know from where I am coming. He asked me, and I said that I am coming from Mugir Mandir. I, he said, you belongs from. You know Raja Raghunandan? I say, yes, he is my grandfather. Then he hugged me and said, oh, you are my grandson. I surprised, first time I am meeting and he said, grandson to me. <coughs> How is possible? Then he said, you don't know my very good relation with your grandfather, with your family. So I know very well your deity name is Radha Mohan. So I know how the service is going on. I say, very nice. Everything is going well, but I am very busy in my business. I cannot give my time for that. He said, no, no, you have to give time. Your grandfather was so rich. You are not like that. So, but he is giving time. Why not you are giving time? I say, if you bless me, I will give time. And this come in my life to give time for Allah. This way, he blessed me that time that he will go preaching all over the world. And this happened in my life. 
in the mercy of Mahajans. They, when they say something, it's happened in the life. And this happened to me. Hey. Guru Maharaj's name is Radha Govindas Bhavaji Maharaj. He was born in also king family from Bangladesh. And when he was 10 years old, he comes to Vrindavan. And he lived 110 years after that. He left his body, he went to the Goloka, left his body when he was 120 years old in 1980. And I took mercy from him and he sent me to Prabhupada. This my this meeting with Prabhupada also is mentioned in the Friends of Prabhupada. One book of Friends of Prabhupada. There is mentioned my meeting. One person interviewed me and he write uh, in that book. It's really great mercy for me of meeting of Prabhupada in my life. You see, I am sannyas of Brahmaditya Maharaj, and he is the disciple of Prabhupada. So means I am become in the spiritual world also like a grandson of Prabhupada. You see. I went to take mercy from him and he gave mercy to me. He accepts me, he loves me, he cares me and he bless me to do this. And I surprise when I any place I go to the scorn in any corner of the world. I got the sure prasadam. Prasadam, very love, care of Prabhupada. And I feel this is all mercy of Prabhupada. I see, when I was a child, I remember I see Bhakti Daita Maharaj personally and he put his hand on my head and blessed me and said that you will become devotee. I see Kesha Maharaj, Guru of Narayan he also blessed me because I went with my grandmother and he blessed me. He said, you will become devotee. You will take it to the service of Radha I remember this. It was Matra. <coughs> and I see Ananda Mema. She's a great soul. She's near to my temple, next to neighbor to my temple. Everyone is coming to see Ananda Mima. And we have a free entreat for her. We can go anytime when we want. And when we are a child, I'm playing in the lap of Ma. He was very happy and he is taking care like a child to me. And I was I was very fortunate to take this. I see Ramdas Babaji. When he is doing kirtan from his eyes the 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 water is coming like a sour. And I was child, I don't know, I I cast that water. And I put it in my head, I don't know what is this meaning, but it's a mercy for me. It's all mercy together come in my life. I see Sripad Baba, he was very good friend of me. I see Akhandanan Sursati, 
is very literate, very nice. Bhagavata, he knows too many Bhagavata and all Shastras. He was very, at his time, he was one of the best person to talk about Bhagavata. What is my realization on this point? Yes. I always preach for the real goal. What is the real goal and how to go? And how the base is this? For the what is the important base is our spiritual master. Yes. Where I took the shelter, we have to keep that shelter. We don't need to change that shelter. We have to develop more faith in our spiritual master. And this faith can take us to the goal. And what is my goal? Goal to how to understand myself, the soul consciousness. How to understand what is the relation with the soul to the super soul. And what is the soul? What is meaning of the soul? And where, how to increase this consciousness? Self-realization, self-consciousness, and how to practice, to develop, to understand about the super soul is the supreme personality of Godhead, and that is only Krishna. That is the goal. We can go to this goal when we are fixed in one place with our spiritual master. Um. Radha Rani is a really Radha is the main who can show us to the Krishna. You know. Guru is the servant of Radhika and Radhika is the way to go to Krishna. Simple way I want to say you. Guru is bringing us to Radhika because Guru is the servant of Radhika and Radhika knows how to bring to Krishna near. We cannot search Krishna easily, but Radhika can open our heart to see Krishna close way, to, to serve Krishna very closely. That is the divine mercy of Radhika, Kishori. And that Mahaprabhu comes to give us. Because Mahaprabhu is covered by Radha Bhav. Means Radha's externally, Radha is outside in the form of Gauranga, inside is Krishna. So Radha is first to go Krishna. No problem. I am a servant, I can serve, what you would say, I am a servant of Radhika, I am a servant of Mahaprabhu, I am ready to serve. If they have desire to know about love and what is the difference between the material love and spiritual love. That is my coming is useful because my main subject I say about the love, how to increase love for Supreme Lord. How to do this? How to develop our consciousness? And this is very important. First thing we have to decide, we want to become religious or we want to develop my spiritual consciousness. 
if they have desire to develop a spiritual consciousness a spiritual love for the lord i'm ready to go yeah say only this that we have to increase relations we have to understand ourselves who i am and why i come and what we are doing if i become 60 years old what i achieve in 60 years if i know achieve anything now we don't need to waste our time we have to realize to do the right thing and we have to do the right thing we are fortunate we have a chance to do because we got the human body you got the mind to think and we got the all senses to use in right way so these these senses can help us this mind can help us and this body can help us if i have a right direction to go on 